Moving our operations to the Okanagan was a very conscious choice for us. I first came here with my wife and we walked into the Innovation Center in downtown Kelowna for the first time. I still remember being taken back. I just instantly felt inspired by what I saw. Not only because of the commitment to startups and new founders, but also the culture and the community that was here that was thriving. My name is Brad Peterson and I'm the chairman and co-founder of Pila in the manufacturing industry here in Kelowna. Most people know us first as Pila, which is a waste innovation company committed to creating a waste-free future. Our first major products were compostable phone cases. They were made from flax straw, which was a byproduct from the agriculture industry in Saskatchewan and would have otherwise been burned and wasted. So after our success with the phone cases, we found that there was a lot of customers who were reaching out saying, hey, I bought your compostable phone case and now I've got a new phone and I need to get rid of my existing case, so where do I put it? And we really didn't have a good answer for them because most people don't have access to home composting environments. So we took a note from the Tesla playbook and asked ourselves, why can't we democratize this process at people's homes? If we can turn every home into an electric charging station for cars, then why can't we turn a home into a composting infrastructure? So we created the Lomi, a composter that turns your organic waste into dirt overnight, right on your kitchen counter at the push of a button. Succeeding in the manufacturing industry requires a lot of ingenuity. Lomi is really the key to unlocking and accelerating the compostable, clean economy. And we feel that that's possible to do that in every home in North America with Canada leading the way. So my background has always been around making things. I've been a creator basically since the beginning of my life. Consumer products have been a big part of what I've done most of my life. I think manufacturing is really a unique art form. It's a way of expressing creativity. And I think it's what we're all called to do is we're called to be creators. I'm a big believer that if you wanna be inspired, you should go outside to places that inspire you. And this place screams for it. When you consider the metrics, we can look around at quality of life, living, housing, affordability, growth opportunities, and they're all pretty great. But the one metric that we win bar none is the beauty metric. The Okanagan is number one in wins, hands down. People here all live in a postcard.